name is Mandy Lynn. I'm the author of the young adult novel Essence and historical fantasy novel I Am Mercy. And today I'm going to be doing an unboxing of another bookcase club. Um, and before we get into that, I just want to say I'm really looking to opening this box because I'm having a bad week. Um, yesterday I went to go do my laundry and in the midst of doing my laundry I didn't realize my was in the laundry basket. Um, I placed my phone just right plop on top of the laundry basket like so and then I went to go do my laundry and I went and just poured all my clothes in there and then like 10 minutes later I was looking for my phone. Couldn't find it upstairs, couldn't find it downstairs, even looked in the fridge. It wasn't in the fridge. Um, and then my, my dad and my mom were like, hey, you should check the washing machine. Depressing terms. The Bookcase Club is a once monthly subscription service. Um, so what you do is that you sign up. You can either just buy one month or multiple months, and you choose what genre you like. Some genres only um, come like four times a year or something like that. I think that's like the cookbook one. But anyways, I'll leave all the details down below as well as I am a book club affiliate. So if you do buy one of their bookcases. Um, use the link down below so you can help me out. Anyways, I'm going to open this. This is the November box and I haven't opened it yet and we're going to hope that I don't accidentally like stab myself with these scissors. Okay, so I'm just going to have you guys join me on this. We open it. Ooh. Okay, so we have the usual, but... all the misery but the beauty that still remains and Frank's diary of a young girl. Ooh, I started reading that book but I never finished it. Um, and then this is just all their social media links and then Melissa is the one who packaged this for me this time and it says happy Thanksgiving. We hope our holidays are filled with warmth, food, and family along with the time to enjoy these things. With all the hustle and bustle of the season be sure to set aside some time to dive into our latest book selections. And this box for this month. Um, so once again, we have one hard cover and one soft cover. I actually recognize the covers for both of these. I just, um, I, ha I don't know what they're about, but I'm, I'm about to read the synopsis for you guys. So first one up is Reality Boy by A.S. King. Um, and apparently A.S. King is a Pulitzer Prize winner. Um, and I think I, I'm familiar with everything about me. You know nothing. Gerald Frost started feeling angry even before his mother invited a reality TV crew into their home when he was just five years old. Twelve years later, he's still haunted by his rage-filled youth and his anger issues have resulted in violent outbursts and zero friends. No one cares that Gerald has tried to learn to control himself. They're all just waiting for him to snap, and he's starting to feel dangerously close to doing that. In his fearless portrayal of a boy on the edge, highly acclaimed Prince Prize author A.S. King explores the desperate reality of a former child star who struggles to break free of his anger by creating possibilities he never knew he deserved. That sounds really good, actually. I like really like the cover for this, and I feel like it's different from most young adult novels as well. So. Like I said, once the semester's over, I have like this huge pile of books that I need to get into, and this is going to be like on the top of that pile. Okay. 
Okay, next up is the beautiful hardcover one. We have Maybe One Day by Melissa Cantor. Uh, in the face of tragedy, friendship is everything. Oh, I don't know why I said it like that. Um, but this cover just feels nice. That is pretty. I don't know if you guys can properly appreciate this, but look at how like it's got so much texture to it. I'm sorry. I just like taking the dust jackets off and admiring this. I'm just gonna read you guys the synopsis now. Zoe so and her best friend Olivia have always been. Zoe so and her best friend Olivia have always had big plans. They'll tour the world as prima ballerinas and live in swanky Manhattan apartment where they'll hang out with their fabulous boyfriends, of course. But when they're cut from the ballet company, their plans for the future evaporate. Suddenly, Zoe's dodging cheerleaders who want her and Olivia to go out for the squad, and Olivia's got a crush on Calvin Taylor, who Zoe can't stand. Zoe can't imagine anything worse happening until Olivia gets sick really sick. Suddenly not being able to dance is at least their problems. Olivia has always been the nice one, the happy-go-lucky one. Zoe has always been the snarky one, the look on the dark side one. But when your best friend is in the hospital, you better learn to step up fast. Now Zoe needs to put on the brave face and be the positive one. Even when Zoe isn't sure what to say. Even when Olivia misses months of school. Even when Zoe starts falling for Calvin. The one thing that keeps Zoe moving forward is knowing that Olivia will be way it was before. It has to, because the alternative is too terrifying for Zoe to even imagine. Okay, so upon, like, I'm reading these synopsises the first time with you guys, and upon, like, the first half of the synopsis, I was like, ugh, like, I really, I, I'm not a chick flip person. Like, like, two girl best friends, like, the best friend stories are not my thing. Um, add in the fact that someone is dying and sick. Um, so this one, I feel like this one could go either way with me, but I'll have to see how this one is, but I think it's still more exciting than the other one, I'm not going to lie. Anywho, these are the two books that were in this month's box, and I can't wait to get to them, and I hope you guys, uh, sign up for your own subscriptions, because they're actually really awesome service. This is, again, the second box that I've, I've gotten from them, and it's like, I just, I just like getting a surprise book. I'm not responsible enough to pick out my own books anymore. This is where subscription boxes come in handy. Anyways, thank you for watching. Be sure to give the video a thumbs up and subscribe. All the links 